Oh, oh. there you go. Sit there. What? Go to Mish. Where? Right ahead of us. Right there? Yeah. <laughs> I fell asleep inside that place once. David's Bridal. Baby Shopping Amy. for a wedding dress for a marriage that wasn't going to last. Didn't even happen. Shopping for a wedding dress in a wedding that never happened. Cornell would have looked beautiful in that dress. They never gave him a chance. Hashtag love wins. Love wins. It's by the way, uh, Ciroc Amaretto is fucking good. I drank a whole bottle of that, and apparently I was very greedy about it. Oh my god, I think that dude just took shit. That's lovely. Oh, never mind. Take it back. But yeah, uh, last time I drank the bottle of um, the Amaretto, uh, <laughs> I was told that I looked very greedy because like, I was drinking and she was drinking beer and every time she was like, oh, can I try some more you're having? I'm like, yeah, sure. So I'd give her the cup, but I guess I was staring at it the whole time. She's like, do you want it back? I'm like, oh, no, 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 go ahead. I didn't, uh, I didn't mean to just stare. But yeah, I would like it back, please. That shit is great. Made a very crucial mistake in that I drank the whole bottle and felt horrible. So oh, my guy was at home. I was talking to you, I believe. I think so. Yeah, I was talking to you and uh, mentioning just how horrible I felt. I went to sleep super early. Like I, after you signed off, I was just like, I'm just gonna watch an episode or something and just sleep this day away. No, I thought I'd feel like crap today. Slept in, I was tired, and then I uh, got drunk. My intentions before like uh, going to Guitar Center was actually taking a nap beforehand so that I could be awake for the live stream. But then I got whisked away. They kidnapped me. And they made me drink stuff. They held you down and forced you? Nah, but he fucking ordered a drink and I ain't gonna turn it down, so. Yeah. Then I ordered a drink that was nasty as fuck. I got some sort of sour, but it didn't say it was a sour. As soon as it touched my lips, I was like, oh. I made a horrible mistake. Sometimes you just wanna show up somewhere and just grab some dinner, man. Because they know that the person they're with is hot and ready at the moment, but won't be for too long. That is a damn shame. And that guy, he knows he has time. He knows he's got it on lockdown. He's like, nope, not going anywhere. Got this. We came to a nice area to fuck up the cars and leave. Cause we're from a poor neighborhood. The poorest in the country apparently. I saw the report. Is it really the poorest in the country? No, well like it's the news Has anchor. Has it been in Detroit? The news anchor, <laughs> not the poorest, but like the news anchor was like, one of the poorest communities in the country. Like, fuck you. We don't live in that horrible of an area, do we? No. Mm -hmm. Man, Amanda lives in a pretty shitty area. Yeah, but it lives ourselves houses. No, it does. Ours, ours doesn't have houses, but it also doesn't have that much crime, I guess. I can tell you, I'm not involved in it. Yeah, I mean, I'm not involved in the crim criminal element of my city. Good. I'm not ready to get taken down by association. Yeah. There's video proof of you already talking about terrorist stuff. <laughs> and I'm I don't... About... I just say things, man. My beanie's slowly falling off. I'm taking my hat off. I mean, even without a hat, I'm really hungry, by the way. We should, we should go inside, I'm really hungry. All right, let's hope we don't lose sleep.